Hey, what's going on guys? It's No Shoes and we're back with another one and today we're going to be reacting to Let the Rhythm Hit Him from Eric B and Ra Kim. This is suggested by Timbo Slice, so thank you Timbo for the suggestion. Keep coming in the comments down below. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. But without any further ado, let's get right into it. Let's see what Let the Rhythm Hit Him is all about. Let's see what Eric B and Ra Kim got for us. Let's get it. Very interesting. Okay, so it starts off. Video feels like it's gonna be some type of movie. We got the or the cops on the chase and everything. Love the like old grainy quality. Hard to imagine what kind of camera they were probably using. But then Rod Kim, I feel like I'm starting to notice this more and more with his tracks. There's never really a drop. He just kind of starts spitting, which there's nothing wrong with that, but it's definitely uh, unique. And uh, it's interesting how you haven't really seen that bleed into too many other rappers, especially in this realm. You know, you got your rappers like uh, Earl Sweatshirt and people like that who sometimes more just talk over beats. And with beats like that, it's easy to leave it without a drop. But Rakim is definitely different in that style but let's see where it goes Let the rhythm hit him. Mm. 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 i got a tiller lyrics and ammo rounds of rhythm then i'm gonna give him piano mm. bring a bulletproof vest stuff in the ricochet ready aim at the brain and what the trigger say mm. tempo's trifle felt like a rifle mm. massage and melodies might go right through mm. simultaneously like a oozy nothing can bruise me Uzi, and then I think he went to confuse me, then lose me. Some nice compound rhymes, especially early compound rhymes. Simultaneously, like a Uzi, nothing can lose me. Lyrics let up when ladies say don't lose me. So reload quickly, and you better hit me. Or I'm letting this feet feet get with me. The step of a double, no seven, better make it snappy. No time to do your hair, baby. Brothers busting at me, beast, and bullets pass me, not on target. They want the hard hit, but watch the guard get. Bring up the tongue with the trigger. Not on target, watch the god get. Breaking these words apart, rhyming like syllables of each word, constructing that. That's beautiful, man. Great work, as always, with these Eric B and Rock Him tracks. Y'all already know what I'm going to say. I'd love to hear a remastered version of this. Just something to boost it up a little bit compared to, you know, the music we listen to now. The levels just aren't there. It feels very thin and... um. Rakim's voice especially is kind of sitting more within the beat and the beats already kind of quiet so it'd be great to hear somebody go back take these tapes and just bring them up a little bit in the volumes and uh in that thickness but still a classic let's keep it rolling Pass me on on target. They want the hard hit, but watch the guard get. Bring up the tone with the trigger. Cause I'm real fast. Let us live them at them. Let them feel the blast. Penetrated a crazy rate. This ain't the very eight. Hit them at point blank range to watch them radiate. Run them out of ammunition. I'm done with them. You ask me how I did them. I let the rhythm hit them. I push a power that's punishing. Prepare to be a prisoner. The hitman. A nice choice instead of having a hook there insert a little break and then that transition to the break using the title of the track as the last line of that verse works very well i love the feel of let the rhythm hit them that rhyme back to back sounds great together the repetition there I push a power that's punishing, but better be a prisoner. The hitman is the brother with charisma. Showing you that I have power. Oh, did we just get Ip Man reference? I thought only Wu Tang was allowed to talk about him. I push a power that's punishing, but better be a prisoner. The hitman is the brother with charisma. Showing you that I have powerful paragraphs. Followers become leaders, but without a path, you're mentally paralyzed. Quick with your third eye, bomb for blur, then it occurred that you heard I reduced the 
friction for crucifixion. Let loose the mixing. Boost the piston. Never hit him with some of that. Cuffed like a lumberjack. And me getting hit back. It won't be none of that. I'm untouchable. You see me in 3D. When I let the rhythm hit another MC. Lyrics made a lead into your head. Then I'm rapture like a mass production. The spread when music is louder. Full of gunpowder. Microphone machinery when I see a crowder. And the instrumental does have a nice feel to it. It's, a, it's some cool ideas here. You know, obviously the drums, they're not doing anything too crazy. They're giving us the structure. They're hitting a pretty standard pattern. Nothing super wild. But then you've got like uh, almost like a guitar or something with like a wah pedal type of feel to it. Kind of going like, just kind of in the background. Then you got the sirens coming every so often, definitely becoming more part of the music than really like synchronizing to the video. And then on top of that, you have just this kind of like kind of sound coming through every so often as well. It's a great combination. They all work well together. So the spread when music is loud, full of gunpowder. Microphone machinery when I see a crowd of party people bumping their fists like this. Thinking that I might miss, but the R is accurate. Plus, I'm packed with educated punchlines that I have to hit. Whatever I aim at, I line them up. Your body is weak, feel a pain. That time is up. You've been hit with something different, isn't it? Rockin' is gonna radiate. Nothing's equivalent. Nothing can harm me. Why try and bomb me? You could move around with Rob with an army. You can wreck by the architects, so respect them. I disconnect. I feel. It seems like one of the overarching themes of this track is his comparing, like, his rhymes and bars to bullets essentially there's a lot of talking you know we first start talking about the compound rhymes with the uzis and then he's talking about you know the cops having their aim on him now him having his aim on other people and all these different things but i would take that to be like a metaphor for the rhymes nothing can harm me why try and bomb me you could look around and rob with an army you can wreck by the architects so respect them i disconnect them soon as i inject them the radiation put them by the basement bust his chest so bash his face and let it split him since he fought his main man with him he asked me how i did him i let the rhythm hit him let it hit him dance floor is dangerous packed in like a yeah, real interesting. Those like short little four bar breaks. We got a little another instrument in there, which is a great choice because during those breaks and bridge sections, you definitely want to add something that takes you out the normal uh, feeling of the track that you're used to and kind of push it in a slightly different direction to really give that reprieve. And we got these... You know, you could call them keys. I don't know what instrument is actually, but it's just like do 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 do. Just like once every like two bars during that bridge, it works great. Just a tiny little bit of salt, a little extra flavor there. Real rough rhyme beats with deep bass. Girls with tight pants, maybe they might dance tonight if the odds on the mic. It's a slight chance the crowd is crucial. Tight pants to might dance to slight chance. Again, these are great compound rhymes. Some of them perfect, some a little bit more bent. Mike dance tonight if the odds on the mic. It's a slight chance the crowd is crucial. MC's grounds are neutral. Now that you're here, let me introduce you. Get ready. I'm hard to read like graffiti, but steady. Sounds a drop is real heavy. <laughs> That's funny. Hard to read like graffiti. Honestly, there's sometimes I see people's tags and I'm like, dog, I don't know how you expect anybody to know what your name is, bro. <laughs> like, it looks dope, but I can barely read cursive sometimes. As the crowd is crucial, MC's grounds are neutral. Now that you're here, let me introduce you. Get ready. I'm hard to read like graffiti, but steady. Science, a drop is real heavy. Radiant energy, that'll be the penalty. Just the third rail of the pain and remedy. The prescriptions one every hour. Now it's a habit. You need another hit from the freestyle fanatic. Attention, follow directions real close. Keep out of reach. And I think we also get, I'm not sure how often this happened in this, uh, you know, time period per se. This looks like it came out in 1990. At least that's when the copyright is registered for. But um, the repetition of the Fs here. Let's bring it back just a little bit. That um, Somebody educated me the other day. You got alliteration. You got consonants, which is rep 
uh, something about repetition of consonant sounds and then assonance, which is repetition of a uh, of uh, vowel sounds. I'm not sure if this is technically alliteration or consonants, but he repeats these two F's back to back and it's got a great feel to it. Yeah, freestyle fanatic. I love the feel of that. Now it's a habit and need another hit from the freestyle fanatic Attention, follow the Rex is real close, keep out of reach of children Beware of four those too many milligrams The one made an ill a jam, my rhymes is the build of my thoughts and kill a man Ideas for the air to fit, my spoon Hold up, is that just in the track? One second Reach your children, beware of four those too many milligrams The one made an ill a jam, my rhymes is the build of my thoughts and kill a man Ideas for the air to fit, my spoon yeah, that little that little pop there. That's that's a little bit past lo-fi level. But <laughs> again, I, I reiterate, I'd love to hear a a remixed and remastered version of this where everything's just polished a little further and those levels are brought up because I think it would be awesome to hear this with just modern le music levels if that makes sense. I know everybody in the comments is always like, just turn it up. Look, dog, listen to everything at the same volume, and then you'll start to understand what I'm actually talking about with these, you know, the levels of the pieces of the instrumental and everything. Regardless, that little pop is ugly. If it that it would be better for that not to be there. What's a killer man? Ideas for the head of fear. Might split them. They'll never forget them. He'll rest in peace with them. At least when he left, he'll know what hit him. The last breath of the world of death was the river. Yeah, that's Yo, and can we just say for a second, this guy, he is living his best damn life. Look at that little man right there, just doing his thing, not a care in the world. And that's a fire suit as well. If I swore to catch up hell in the wicked as I kicked it, no need to remix it, cause I prefixed it, reverse the switch to perform the perfection, section for section, rhymes keep connecting, you're guessing what's next, then blood pressure rises, you damn near lost it, hit the ground burning and woke up frosted, cause when I explain you can't go. Oh, he's a police officer. Okay, there's a little bit of story going on here. It's interesting. I noticed this the other day with, um... I think it was 911 is a joke from Public Enemy. The tendency of music videos around this time period to kind of play like the dual narrative game of having one just like rock him rapping as if he's at a bar just performing for people and then two the outside the story on the outside of that of like the guys here look like they're arresting that woman or a actually are they not cops? It looked like he giving her <laughs> look like he giving her some drugs there. I don't know what's happening exactly, but either way, the two stories run in parallel, the parallel editing. It's a, it's a cool idea and it works well, but it's interesting. The tendency towards that. Connect and you're guessing what's next Then blood pressure rises, you damn near lost it Hit the ground burning and woke up frosted Cause when I explain, you can't complain for pain Travel through the brain, hit a vein, then remain Let it radiate, vibe or vibrate Why did you violate? Now I'ma have to let the style break Bones, now the tone is ain't blown After this gets thrown, give me another microphone Before I get that feet fee I met Whisper, I wanna reach your intellect Kiss her, cause I wanna give her the most respect So I shine and let my light reflect Hold her, mold her, make her feel older they are on my shoulder everything i told her makes her feel secure whenever i'm with her and you know how i did her some early rhyme stacking too with like the older shoulder told colder i don't know if he used all of those exact words but that sound is uh the repetition of that you know like almost every other word at certain points feels great we see that a lot in artists like doom which uh rest in peace to doom man Intellect, kiss her, cause I wanna give her the most respect So I shine and let my light reflect Hold her, mold her, make her feel older Lay her on my shoulder, everything I told her Makes her feel secure whenever I'm with her And you know how I did her, me and the rhythm hit her
Oh, and now we get a little twist on that end, on that uh, transition. You know how I did her. Me in the rhythm hit her. That's, that's cool, man. That works well. That works really well. Nice to have it like a little bit fresher after a whole track at this point as well. Also, this is one of my favorite Rock Him tracks, I would say, especially for the longer ones. You know, I honestly didn't even realize we were already like four minutes through this track, 612, um, full length. So let's keep it rolling. interesting and it feels like we're getting like a break uh i was calling them breaks earlier but this more means like a break to actually dance to now is what i'm referring to having this longer section of just instrumental one it's cool how it kind of allows the story to do its own thing without the uh lyrics of the track over top of it it leaves a great break for us after listening to, like I was just saying, about four minutes of almost completely straight verses, you know, a couple four bar reprieves in there here and there. But um, a great choice to leave in this longer break at the end here. Well, not even the end, but we're getting close. Let's see where it goes now. That is a crazy looking pipe, dog. Wild. Yeah, this is working really well. I, I really expected us to have one last verse before this track ended, but having the instrumental just extend is honestly just as good. I like the feel of it, leaving a nice open ending to the track after everything we heard already. Like I was saying, the story is really developing. Those guys obviously are not the police um, in the suits. I realize that now. Looks like they causing some trouble with one dude's girl or who knows exactly what's going on here. You know, if only we could ask rock him, maybe get it. <laughs> but uh, regardless, the instrumental is still evolving a little bit. It's changing a little bit as we go, keeping it interesting. And uh, let's see how they finish it out. Yeah, and then at the end of the track, it seems like the stories finally sync up with each other. And we see Ra Kim connect with... Was that Eric B that was, you know, running in like with the chains and hung the dude up on the window? I'm not super uh, familiar with what he actually looks, looks like, so it might have been him. Y'all can let me know, and I'm sure if I'm wrong, y'all will yell at me. Regardless, that was Let the Rhythm Hit Him from Eric B and Rock Him. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I certainly did. Thank you again to Timbo Slice for the re for the suggestion. Keep them coming in the comments down below. Let me know what y'all want to see next time. Don't forget to hit like, hit subscribe, and hit that bell if you want to see more videos like this. Much love to everybody in the No Shoes Gang, and I'll see you all 
next time.